Welcome to BAK's lecture. In this video, we will discuss about some of the output devices. The devices which are used to display the data are called as output devices. By using output devices, we can get the data on monitor or on paper or in some other way. We have different types of output devices, monitors, plotters, speakers, printers. In this video, we will discuss about monitors, plotters and speakers. Monitors. We also call it as VDU, means Visual Display Unit. It is a main output device of a computer. It forms an image with tiny dots called pixels. These are arranged in rectangular shape. Like, for example, I want to draw a line. See, is this a line? Absolutely not. So, we have to arrange all these pixels in very closure manner. Again, I reduced the size and also I make them to closure. But still, it is not a line. If the number of pixels are arranged perfectly and in small size, then the sharpness or clarity of the image is perfect. Otherwise, it looks like blur. Now see this. This is the perfect line. Why? Because all the pixels are arranged in very very closure manner. There are two types of monitors. Cathode ray tube monitor and flat panel display monitor. Cathode ray tube monitor. Already we know that by arranging small size of pixels into closure manner, then we get the sharpness of the image or we get the image with perfect clarity. So CRT is used to produce the pixels in small size. Here most screens are available to display 80 characters of data horizontally and 25 lines vertically. These are available in large size. Because of this reason, by using these we will get high power consumption. Flat panel display monitor. By compared to CRT, here we can reduce volume, weight, power consumption also. These monitors are included in calculators, video games, laptop monitor and graphics display also. And remaining all are same as cathode ray tube only. Plotters. These are used to print the vector graphics. These are mainly used in CAD, computer aided design, especially used for engineering purpose. For example, these are used to print construction maps, engineering drawings, architectural plans, business charts, etc. We have four types of plotters, drum plotter, flatbed plotter, inkjet plotter, cutting plotter. We will catch a few points about all these one by one. Drum plotter. It consists of a drum. Here we can wrap a paper around the drum with pin attachment. Then the drum rotates around the paper and then prints the images on the paper. There are two types, external drum plotter and internal drum plotter. In external drum plotter, a paper is wrapped around the external surface of the drum. In internal drum plotter, the paper is wrapped around the internal surface of the drum. In both the plotters, the drum rotates around the paper, then only it prints the image on the paper. Flatbed plotter. In this paper is fixed constantly on a horizontal plane. A pen which is attached to this is used to draw the images by moving horizontally and vertically. In pen we have different colors also. Inkjet plotters. These especially use it to print the images on banners which are placed along the road sides. Cutting plotter. Instead of using pen, a knife is used to cut the paste to draw the designs of any plan. We may observe that somebody stick the naming stickers on the vehicles. Those stickers can be cut in perfect shape by using this cutting plotter. Speakers. This output device is used to convert the digital signals into audio signals. This conversion can be done by using the sound card. These all are about monitors, plotters and speakers. In our next video, we will discuss about working of the different types of printers which are used as an output device. In this video, if you understand the concept, please like, share, subscribe my channel for more videos. Thank you.